The Redeemer has risen. Hey, what is up guys? Marcy here, back to do another first person video. And today I've got another highlight video of the best games I've had in recent times. And boy, are these good games in my opinion. Uh, from start to finish, you guys are going to be seeing some pretty wild action packed games. And I feel like I also have to clarify this is 1.02 plus as well because we're going back and forth between 103 and 1.02 plus nowadays. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoy these games. This is going to be Master Leaf. Peace out. That's why I don't like rushing with Traveller because games end up being a minute and they're no good for me in my YouTube channel. I just, what's the point, right? I have no motivation to do these cheese all-ins and descent rushes because I know that I won't get good games out of them. This is, this is why I don't do it most of the time. Okay, well, Reaper 17, we can do the descents. Do the descents this game. It's gonna be Nod. We're just gonna vote even better for the descents. We can go see if he's uh, Black Hand. Could be the case. We can go for a couple of uh, free descent squad as well. This game, you know, because I just feel. I mean, there's nothing in the rulebook that says you can't do this. I mean, it's not a tournament, so, you know, just let me have some fun. I'll make my free descent. Versus Black Hand. Put the free descent there, you see, Jake? It's the most valuable free descent you can get because it's the four out of the four out of five members. Let's go. Take out that spike. So we gotta go do. We go ahead and take out that spike. And he's not, not going to be able to. Yeah, he's. he's uh, 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 um, no. Why would you do this? A flame opening. This is a pretty big hard counter. Well, this definitely did throw me off. He defends his... That's actually a pretty hard counter there. The random shenanigans. Coming, paying off here. We'll be reckoning it will be coming behind this too. I will expect Reckoner to come. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to aim these rocket squads here. So once I've got rid of the rocket scope with the force attack, the rest of those suckers won't do anything. But I think if you're in that situation, you might as well just aim down the rockets. Probably a lot better for you. Now I'm a bit concerned of a flame tank. If I'm completely honest with you, I am extremely worried about a potential flame tank rush here. So we go ahead and see. That's the case. We've also got this free scan ability as well. So here's hoping he's not rushing flame tanks. What do you know? You see that, guys? We've got the, we've got the flame tank. The flame tank is on its way, sneaking up on us. I'm going to queue an engineer in, in anticipation of losing one of our structures. He's obviously sneaking this one around. That is very annoying, actually. Hey, man, cheers for the follow. Damn it, these, this is so, oh my God, these black, these black hand squad. It's doing so much damage. Oh no, 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 I can't, I can't put my building there. I can't, I can't put my building there, man. What the hell, that, that just, oh, I'm, I'm so confused. Okay, well that would have been embarrassing.
You know what I'm going to do? I'll go four. Drone ship. Can I kill this dude here? There we go. Killed the dude. I'm going to go for the gravity stabilizer. You know, he likes the air, so we'll do the air as well. Nothing in the top, in the bottom. We're just going to sit here on top of this on top of this wall factory, get some repairs, some free repairs, mind you. You could have a flame tank hiding in the corner still. That's very, very possible. I don't know how ever if he's going to go for infantry switch after this. I'll go to this field just because I feel that. I mean, it's twisted rift for a reason. For infantry, actually. Infantry? Really? Oh my god, he's going infantry. Okay, this is not good. Alright, you got a base here? I don't know. Base? Yeah, you do. Let's take those out. Devour tanks to your other base. Wait, what? Oh, I can't, I can't see the unit. Oh, I think I've lost this game. There, I've lost it. Uh, I could sell this war factory off, couldn't we? Oh, taking taking a lot of damage there, isn't he? Is this even harvesting? Yeah, it is just about though. Thinking a bit slow here, really. Oh, I'm not. Oh my god, I'm just falling apart, man. That's game over. Damn, I lost one. All right, cool. Thing is, I'm so behind now, it's not even funny. Because my harvesters weren't even harvesting. Okay, well, I need this dev tank doing tons of work here for me. Uh, can maybe sneak around, try and kill this harvester. Every piece of damage that I can do is vital at the moment. He's letting so much damage get done to him, though. Oh no, he's taking out my other base. Storms, though. They are really doing significant damage. He's losing so many harvests to it. One storm rider remains. go back for them actually 
I know, he's going to take up to tier 3, no doubt. Hmm. Back for more Storm Riders? Could be the way to go. I'm not sure how this game's even a thing. But... Oh, he's moving out here. Okay, I see what's going on. Wait for these rocket squads to acquire targets. And then I'll use the swarm support power on them. Because once they've acquired targets, they don't shoot. See if there's anything over here which we can destroy. Okay, maybe a harvester potentially. Nothing. Nothing down here. Okay. Well, both of us are kind of sloppy, to put it mildly, currently. Oh no. It's a battle of the tier three. I think he's tagged up to tier three now. Yes, got that one. Very, very good. All right, got these here. Gonna go for the, his field with this drone ship. If he loses this tier two, then he won't be able to tech up. Surprised I haven't lost my power there. No double A, so he's going to be pretty exposed here. No tier 2 either. So how about that? Let's cash in while we can. And this last game is pretty... Just, the same thing is happening to him as it did to me in that uh, Badlands game. He's lost all of his harvesters. Well, these definitely showed out of nowhere. No double A though, which means he's pretty screwed. Does have a tech center, so... Considering how he's on tech now, he's probably going to do some sort of cheese push to me. I'll use some shard walkers in anticipation of this infantry that he's going to build. Okay, take this field over here. It'll be obelisk for days, no doubt. I'm going to leave these over here just to harass his expansion later. Sorry, he's going to probably be um, mining there. Well, that is very annoying, isn't it? Uh, MCV maybe that we can take out oh no this is a bit wasteful if I'm not careful yep exactly as I predicted would be the case anyway we could go and attack his, his, his vitals while this is all happening retreat back to base Try and sneak around here, see if we can find any harvesters. There's one there, just gonna queue these suckers up. MCV. Oh no. Exactly as predicted would be the case. He's going to have to queue double A defenses. Um, 
that just absorbed a whole obelisk shot and it's at full health. Man, those shields, they don't half tank that damage. Ah, uh, whatever. Unload your tib. Actually, let's get out. Do I get out of here? It's in the way that. Take out this, maybe queue an engineer, take care of that. That, that was a, a weird ass game. Unload your tip soldier, unload your tip. Huh? I don't understand. I don't understand what you're talking about. Sell Texan. No, I had to build a tech to kill his tech because I knew he would try and do some cheese after I killed his um, harvesters with the storms. One thing I didn't do was get a hexapod. I don't, I, I don't, I'm not Devi I'm not Skrin, I don't have Devastator Warships, so that was literally the best I could do. This is why I want to get another fan for my PC, because I can hear it very loud on that right there. So if I can get another fan on that CPU caller, I can then reduce the RPM of that fan, and then th the noise level should be a little less. It mostly distracts me more than anything. But, uh, yeah. I'm not sure if you guys can hear that, probably can't, I don't know. But... Yep. I don't know, if you guys are into PC hardware, I can talk about that all day. Super happy about my alt tab working again. Uh, it hasn't worked since I bought this PC. Just, it just hasn't worked. Because of the, the driver issues. But, you know, today got fixed. After one year. One year, eh? But at least they fixed it. Better late than never. So, you know, I can alt tab and now I will not um, lag. So I don't need to double alt tab like I did before, which kind of tilted me. Okay. Oh, it's going to be Jedi versus uh, Nod. I'm not sure why this is a close fight. It should be a pretty, pretty one sided fight, but no. Oh, no, no, no. Actually, I'm still Talons. I thought it was GDI. Okay, well, it doesn't matter then. Whatever. Let's go back. Where's my other scout? There's one here. I must have cleaned up triple militant squads. He's going to go ahead and he's going to clean that up. No, not quite. Not quite. Okay, he's got another militant there. So it's just ready this one back. Did I grab these bikes? Yeah, I did. Got both of them. Going to do the Haru trick. Haru specs. You know, that guy. Going to do his trick here. So I get more resources. Look at those rifles dodging those militants all day. No, the rifle squads are just better trained. You know, of course they'd be better trained. I mean, they're in the, in the actual military. Whereas I'd imagine Nod is like conscripts. They can't run as fast as the the trained infantrymen of the right of the GDI. But then I don't know. Nod got all the scientists. That's how they got like lasers and stuff to make up for their lack of training. I mean, there must be mo no more Nod followers, right, than GDI if they're able to recruit such large militant squads like that. I mean, they must have so many followers, the Brotherhood of Nod. So far, so good. Okay, can't go for these blue tip builds and this map. I just might just go EMP, EMP spike on this map. It's a very interesting discovery that we just made just then. Uh, and bikes. This bike's ready. This bike's ready. The attack bike is here. Okay, well, I'm just going to drop me down a tower and eco up. Go see how he uh, also response to this as well oh no not my harvester not the harvester watched how though actually it scares those back which is really nice 
I guess he's hoping just to delay this for as long as possible. No, click, 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 click. Can I? Oh, I can't um, brace my units out there. Not cool. Come on. Where are you going for now? Tier 2? Games are always tense versus Futurama, as you can see. Okay. Uh, let's get some hubs and grenades, APCs, APCs, yeah, that's what we want. Okay. Holy crap. That must be the, uh, wow, did you not get that harvester? Apparently he didn't. So many bikes in such a small map. I haven't got many harvesters, really, do I? Oh no, he didn't, he didn't evac that. Got one more down here, probably has, I don't know. Okay, actually this house is pretty much as though it was dead. So Bryce is making all this aggression work on such a tiny map again, that's uh, pretty surprising to me. I guess he's going to take up the tier 3 now, yeah he's on tier 3 going for stealth tanks. Futurama proving his stamina here. Versus me, I've been playing for like three hours already and he's, he's, he's okay. I mean, I've seen him play bike a million times and he's like, yeah, no problem, right? I can just play b bike and all day long, all night even. And I don't know if I'm going to be able to come through here. He's found another gap in my base. I, I get, yeah, I'm making these people because of the uh, stealth tanks. I should have gone for two war factories now, come to think of it. Avatars, yeah, he's on tier 3. My tier 3 kind of sucks versus his. I'm going to have to go for an Ion Cannon. It's going to be one of those campy ass games, unfortunately. Okay. Right, so what is he, what's he doing now? I really haven't had any bit of aggression at all since the beginning of this game. Oh no. Do I not space those out properly? Do I really not space those out? I, I, I built this to specifically to space them out though. Oh, he's going for a redeemer. Oh no, don't lag, don't lag. I'm trying to get the engineer here, please. There we go. Wow, look at that. Oh, that's why I'm, oh, that's why I'm skewed for funds. Stored for funds. Trying to build this ion cannon, which I need e ASAP. Redeem is coming out. He's going for vertigos. Oh my god, he's already on to it as well. Both of us have the same ideas. However, he has freaking vertigos out on the map, and I don't know how to contend with those. I guess I need to go for a firehawk. And Juggernaut's behind this. Yeah, I think I'll go for a double quad engineer as well. Get a couple, one firehawk out just to deal with that. I'm going to use this uh, regrowing ability on my Tiberium field. It takes out my EMP, however, this is kind of a camping map now given you know, the limited resources on it. Probably can't afford to queue units from two uh, buildings at once. If I can try and take out his Tiberium spikes with uh, Firehawks, that would be a great um, pickup. But uh, for now, he's got four Vertigos out. I need to try and get this Firehawk out as soon as possible. Okay. I'm 
surprised she's not dropping the seed Tiberium and whatnot now, but yeah, it's going to be pretty much a campy game. Both of us are going to wait for our super weapons to cool down. Not sure which one's better, I assume, is the... Probably the Iron Cannon since I got it got nerfed or buffed. But yeah, this is uh, Futrama's uh, strength. Now he's... Obviously, I'm Steel Town, so I'm in a disadvantage against uh, camp like this. Oh my god, he just dodged a bullet there. Really, literally. Okay, well. I'm gonna put this here, just let this tip field regrow. And both of us are just gonna sit here and camp for and wait till our super weapon to cool down. Got two avatars there. Okay, and he's got those vertigo bombers somewhere. I'm gonna go ahead and kill those Tybrim spikes. There's a ton of vertigos actually there. Okay. Oh no, no are these not on anti air loadout? Apparently not. If you could get those on the deck, that would be amazing. I don't know how many of those vertigos are used, but... I'm going to go up here and I'm going to take out this uh, shrine in a moment. Okay. Uh, hopefully he doesn't look at this. Look at that. Take out all the vertigos on the deck. Very, very, very nice. No, I'm going to run into those stealth tanks. Actually, the veteran C saves that somehow. Okay, well. We're actually doing okay after that pickup there. That's a really, really good pickup indeed. Well, I guess now I just need to defend this area here with the pit bull. And take this game slowly, take out those those spikes. We've got that redeemer there, okay. Uh, cheers for the follow. And the redeemer, I'm gonna try and empty that and destroy it actually. If we, if we can destroy that, I'll be sick. Those stealth tanks are gonna be a problem again. I'm gonna go ahead and take out those spikes just as he is with my spikes. Okay, that goes down. I guess he's using that to scout me. Let's put this all the way back here in a very enclosed position. Okay. He's got those mass stealth tanks. I'm not sure what he's doing besides that though. He's got avatars everywhere. Uh, I need to watch for those um, stealth tanks once again. So I'm ready to queue back to base immediately. Stealth tanks are right there actually. So we can go ahead and uh, kill this uh, tier 3. I know that he's got his thing there, so I'm going to go ahead and take out the tech. Where's that mob? It's over here, okay. I guess he's limiting the place where the uh, nuke can go. Trading nicely, I guess. Okay. Again, it's a very limited map, this, so... I can see where his tech buildings are, so I'm just going to go ahead and bomb these two. Not sure how I can see that, but... I can, for whatever reason. Wow. Of all things, you would build those. I've got Firehawks, and he's like, you know what I'm gonna do? Why are these not harvesting? My harvest is stuck in the ref. Mate, I, ca I cannot. This is why I've got no funds, because my harvester. 
No, it's, it's not working. The, the, there's no, it's not working, man. I don't know what's going on with that, but my harvester's bugged here. Man, that sucks. I, I can't... This, this harvester went unload. It won't go out. This is game breaking. I can't... I can't do anything. Well, I guess I'm dead now. Wow. What a, what a way to go. What a way to go. Okay. Takes out that. Although he's probably going to nuke it anyways. But actually what I should do is get uh, this here. That uh Ugh. I need a mammoth or two, I think, in this game. A way to EMP M2. We should just nuke my Tiberium as Bike Rush does all the time. I need a superior way of dealing with stealth tanks, that's for sure. Um, I'm kind of spread out, but I have to be versus the super weapon. Sensor pods, who said sensor pods? Do I even have a tier 2? Got a radar scan. Where's my tier two? Can barely see on this map. It's such a hard map to see things on. Okay. It's a bit like Tournament Galaxy. This, unfortunately. I mean, that's not a good thing. Nope. Whoa, look at that reaction time, man. That was, that's pretty damn sick, the way that he did that. Nope, that sucks. Okay, I'm out of position here for sure. He's got his... Again, I don't want to get out of position still in this game. Keep this here. That mav tank, I really needed one around. Well, he's lost all of his Vertigo bombers. Got, still got the Orca. It's going to be a tactical game, this, if I've ever seen one. Keep away from those stealth tanks. And hope that he makes a mistake in this game. That's what I'm hoping for. Whoever uses the super weapon better will win. I just realized something, the, sup the supersonic airstrike is kind of useless. I should use my regrowing as well. If I regrow too, I'm going to get more resources than him. Okay. He's got his thing there, Redeemer. He needs to be very, very careful where he goes those stealth tanks around about. He's not going to lose those. Ah, takes a ton of damage there on his MCV. Can I get this MCV if I walk here? Maybe I could just about shell that. No, I can't. Unfortunately. Okay. Oh my god, he's got infantry. It's not good. Where's that mob? We should get it over here too. Stealth tank's keeping put there. He's doing a good job of his micromanagement. Futurama. 
Uh, again, my, my early late game options are kind of crappy though compared to you know the Nod guy. The Nod guy's got so much man spam now, I guess he's going to transition into that. Uh, I don't even have AP ammo, I don't think so. Yeah, I do have AP ammo, what am I talking about? But, I mean, what can I do, really? It's just one of those games. Okay. Uh, I, I just don't like these kind of games. Is these stealth tanks there? No, they're not. He's got a mass infantry. He really loves this kind of style. I don't know if I could have pushed earlier, but... Uh, the only thing I can really go out and harass with is these Firehawks. I've lost my Orca, I'm gonna need another one just for the sensor pods. He knows he's getting revealed as well, so he's making good, some good decisions. Got barracks, cool. Is there another Q juggernauts here? Yeah, we, if we get the Marv somehow, that'd be great. Hopefully that he loses a bit of patience. Okay. Very, very patient, as I said. We're clear. Firehawk here. We're going in. It's got tons of infantry here that I know. How much I don't know, but yeah, they're on hold fire stance or what? I don't understand how that happened. But yeah, those stealth tanks are right there. He's moving around with his mouth. He's got one there. Okay. Ooh, look at that. Obviously, one mistake and he's screwed. Look at that. Gets the order down on that immediately. Not the greatest super weapon in the world, I will say. Not by a long shot. Okay. Well, I'm hoping to get that super weapon off. A really, really great super weapon. If I can... Uh, Okay, that's pretty good. I'll take that. Wait, how many stanks does he have? Nah, I was never going to win this. I've got one behemoth there too. Holy crap. I know, it felt like he had more than me in that. Um, I don't know, I need all these husks, I need them now. Come on. Take those out. Come on. Oh, come on. I cannot kill this redeemer. Is it just in? It's just not dying. Fuck me. Die already. Come on. There we go. Combat engineer, can you do it? No, you can't. Oh, 
get under attack. That's your chance. So, hold it down. Tigreen exposure detected. Oh my god. He brought his aim to begin just as he needed it. Oh I can't I can't block this. Maybe kill this aim CV, get some damage on that, take these out, these husks. This refinery doesn't work. I can't queue in the refinery. Oh, for God's sake, this is such a game. I, I don't know what to say. That one avatar causing problems. He's got... Oh, I've got one mammoth here. Man, this M this ref, it, I cannot dock in it. I just cannot dock in the ref. Unbelievable! Like, what the hell? He just got another base, isn't he? I think he sold everything off. I don't know if he's lost all of his stealth tanks. He's got his nukes still. What a... Like... I don't know what happened this game. Like the, I've never had this bug occur before, but the ref just wouldn't unload Tiberium. My heart was stuck in there the whole game, like completely destroyed me. Okay, well he's got that not infantry half. I don't think I'll be able to do anything against it. Wait, I dug that bunker for him to just go in there, okay. He's kept his nuke around, that's gonna be GG. Oh my god, what a... <laughs> Did I deserve my ref to bug the whole game? I, I couldn't, my ref, my heart was stuck in it, my other harvesters couldn't unload. Uh, I don't know what I'd do for any moment, man. It's not like Green Zero where he's constantly having a fit. And there's many, you know, you can screenshot Green Zero many times and get him doing something like that. Your horse subscribed. Tier one. Is that your first sub horse? Cheers and thanks very much, man, for that subscription. I have two leafy most yeah, but they they were bad ones, right? I'll let you on a little secret though, Jake. It was just between you and me. It was uh, a skincare product, which it wasn't. Uh, wasn't wasn't sweating at that time moment just just then you know between you and me it was not what you think so now your meme has been made irrelevant tiberium leaf tiberium leaf there's a wall there mate Did you see that wall do, 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 walls, don't, walls just don't work, okay. Aggressive panda, actually no, horse gave me that sub. Horse, buddy. That is really nice of you. I even get to see what faction he is. Da, 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 da. Yeah, that sounds awesome campaign streams. I actually tried to, but the campaigns are just too easy. They're simply just too easy. Stream more. Well, I will stream more once I, you know, I've got a, a new monitor coming, horse. When this new monitor comes, tell you what, it's going to be a much easier process streaming. You know what I might do, guys? You know what I might do? 
We go for the double the double engineer. Why? Okay, we can get the five hundred dollar bonus from two tie brim spikes. That's exactly what we're looking for here. So let's go do that. So we're gonna go ahead, grab those two spikes. Oh, there's a, an engineer. There's an engineer right there. Also, he's black hand, which means this is a terrible idea. Do I need to say more? Pitbull. Straight the other spike. Take that over. Okay, well, I mean, it, it, it's not the end of the world here. Titans, he probably is anticipating me to go for like the nothing. But this, he got the fire and dollar bonus. Okay, so he's in a pretty good position now, isn't he? All things considered. Let's use this as a transport now. We're just gonna keep this Reckoner alive, actually. This is gonna be our best option in this uh, very, very game. Okay, all right. Got to order some of these back to base pretty pronto because we're gonna get attacked here by Panic. Close, very, very close. Black Hand Squad still lives, however, so that's pretty good. I actually didn't lose any house there. It's a miracle. That's an absolute miracle what just happened there. Also, we'll try and not jeopardize ourselves in the Tiberium field if we can help it. Pulling the harvesters back, though, definitely was a good idea. Right. So let's uh, secure our Tyrion's box. Actually, this it is still alive. God knows how, but it is. Pretty sure that got destroyed, but uh, apparently not. Right. Two war factories. Why are you going to war factories? Because I want to secure the uh, Tyrion spikes for as long as possible. So we're going to go for this. Get them um, two war factories down. Because we can secure the blue type room as well if we do this. Okay. Oh. Uh, so you have to pull back to base. It's going to be a bit dodgy if he sticks around there, I think. These Wolverines are in a bit of a big exposed, aren't they? We could probably take those out. Oh, he's going to lose a harvester, so that's pretty cool. Uh, he's going to try and aim down that, that bike there. Not going to get it though, the micro will be sufficient. Oh, this is not good. Let's go try and attack my expansion. Let's leave this here, just in case he tries to take that over. Okay. Is it just Wolverines you got going on? You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to spam Scorpions, actually. Scorp Mantis, that's what we're going to do. Ooh, AP ammo shit changes really quick when that comes online. Got these three bikes. So, again, we need to watch for that, that transition to... Uh, Hammerheads, which is a thing. He's gonna get away with that blue Tiberium as well. He was obviously expecting infantry. So I'm gonna expect that. Cue a couple Mantis, just, you know, anticipation of that to come. Because it's more than likely gonna be infantry. Sorry, uh, it's gonna be more than likely it'll be that. Hammerhead transition. Not, then we'll just go back to base. No biggie. S split this one off. 
Okay. Expansion. I'm expecting man to, uh, hammerheads once again, but he's not even building any. Building any hammerheads? No, no hammerheads at all. Well, if that's the case, I'll just go ahead and uh, attack. Take out this harvester here. Here goes nothing. I expect the hammer is to just pop out of the fog. And I guess this shows how bad the hammerheads are. Titans, I meant. And I guess he's got nothing over there, so let's go ahead and punish him. Okay. Anything that we can find here, mate? An expansion, perhaps, that we can destroy? No, we're good. We're going to get this harvester here, and then we're going to... Oh, I lost my, my Q there, unfortunately. Not good. Well, we still have a good opportunity to uh, overrun him still. Uh, maybe not with those photon cannons though. Uh, I guess Scorpion tanks is still the way despite all this, isn't it? That's a leaf ref right there as well. Bit of a panic placement. You'll go for Marath tanks now, so I need to be uh, very cautious about that. I probably need to make a switch soon. Well, you really should have Marath tanks out already, but he doesn't. For whatever reason, he does not. Oh crap. Okay, this, this could have been a little mistake. Sacking those units. I'm just gonna get this, this destroyed. He's gonna move out with his forces. Got two mantis, let's get these over here. He's finally going for the hammerheads now, but at what cost? I think it's a bit too late. Let's get these back to base for repairs too. Was actually a close one. Go for some bikes now, I guess. Okay, awesome. It's a pretty close game, this. Let's go queue some bikes just to do some harassment on his expansion field. He really needs to go for math tanks. I don't know why he's not doing that. I mean, look, these are non-upgraded Scorps and they're taking on freaking Titans. Okay. Ooh. Oh, some Titans over here. I need to be careful about those. Let's pull these back. Cut off the reinforcements. Just destroy him while he's right here. OK, 
Perfekt. Okay, well, he's, I took out the expansion, which is nice. That ref placement, though, is going to cost me big time. Got two more factories, though. I probably need to queue some more bikes just for that harass. And, of course, because of the hammerheads, too, this is why I'm doing this. Let's get that Redeemer hub down as well. Okay. Unit lost. I'm surprised he didn't go into Mav Tanks. I think that's his fault this game. He just didn't go into Mav Tanks. I think that was a pretty big uh, mistake. You usually want to transition as quick as possible to those just so you can contend with the Nod armor like a lot easier. Because Titans are not cost effective at all. Look at that. I mean, they just. You just can pop them instantly. Any like push coming here? I don't know if he's gonna go in for like a one big assault. But that's GG. I don't know how long I've been streaming for either, guys. It looks like I've been going on for one hour and 20 minutes. I don't know if the 2v2 scene has gone off. If they haven't, then I can hop in, you know, stream some 2v2 action as well. Make my stream title accurate and true for once. And also, I mentioned it again, and I'm very excited for this. I got another monitor. It's on its way, but this is great because when you're streaming, you really need that second monitor. So you can monitor your stream, the chat and everything. And it's amazing how it took me this long to realize, Leaf, just, just get a second monitor. You're, you're streaming. But yeah, I, I think I will be able to interact with you guys more on the chat with that. And it's gonna be great. And this uh, G502 mouse as well, which I've had in the drawer for years, isn't too bad actually when you get used to it. It's a very heavy mouse though. It's, it's different, but at least it's wor it works and it's reliable. It's great when I'm video editing because it's got this infinite scroll feature, which is great for scrubbing the timeline. So I feel it's like more appropriate as a productivity mouse. I might travel here because if I am, that's going to suck. No. Reaper 17 versus Scrin. Not particularly the, uh, I can not even play with one monitor. Well, what I'm thinking of is I'm, I'm going to put the second monitor in portrait mode and have it on a vase amount. And then I can use that to monitor things. I'll give you the truth now that I'm using an iPad to... I'm currently using an iPad to monitor my stream. It's, it's acting as a secondary display. However, it is a temporary solution. It works quite well, but the screen is just too small. And it, and it lags my PC too, actually on the desktop. The desktop just shits out when I connect the iPad to it. Okay, right. Well, you know what? <sighs> He's going to think I'm going mechas. However, he will be mistaken. He will be most mistaken because we're not doing that. Instead, we're going to go four the most unorthodox tactic. I'm going to go for the dev tank spam. Yes, that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to go for a couple of devour tanks. And he's going to think that there is... Uh, actually, he's going double war factory. Double war factory dev tanks versus double war factory seeker. Uh, yes, I'll take that. Thank you very much. I will take that. Me? Is that going to be mine? I don't know. Let's go for the Devourer Corruptor combo. Push it to his expansion. Bike Rush style. In fact, Bike probably wouldn't do this. Bike's gonna be like, Leaf, you noob, why are you doing this? This strategy right here. Anyway. We've got a nice load of blue type room coming. He's gonna see this key. He's gonna be like, okay, this is a bit of a dire situation. Actually, there is actually a, uh, yeah, let's go back. 
Let's go back. Take out his Tiber and Spikes, actually. And recover while this is all going on. We're going to recover. Yeah, that's right. However, he get, we're at a disadvantage, though. Because we don't have the free scan. So we can't see where his dev tanks are. I can push that button, though, to reveal his tanks. That is a feature. You know what? I will take that blue Tiberium. $300. Ah, that hurts. But we're going to get ourselves pretty nice mad kills. So we're going to use this sacrificial seeker. He's going to move out of his dev arrow tanks. He's going to move away from his base. This is a pretty huge deal for him. Of course, that is a pretty major deal, especially if he loses two spikes. He could be going ahead and destroying my... He's moving out with his, with his drone ship. Looks like he's doing some sort of crazy, wacky all-in here. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go and attack his base. Uh, maybe? No, I'm not going to do that. You should go ahead and take out my spikes, though, for sure. This leaf, you and your tier 3 and your tier 2 placement was just about the worst possible place you could have put that. I mean, you, you couldn't put it anywhere better, could you? Oh, actually, my drone ship is in deep peril. Let's go ahead and save that, actually. That's terrible news. We uh, lose that. We're going to pull back these devs, too. See if we can snipe something that's reinforcing here. Okay, we've got those dev tanks, and we're going to go for... You know what? Some tripods. Yes, that's what we're going to do. Okay, where are those devs? See those devs right there? We're going to just uh, queue them up because we can see this. See, with that radar, with that scan, we can see everything. That's very, very, very nice. So he's in a pretty dire position now. Actually, let's go back. Repairs here. And this tier two is probably gonna die when he pushes me, so let's go back. We've got the tripods. Which is very nice. Okay, he's gonna go in for this all-in push, I guess, now or not. I don't know. However, what I do know is the longer this game goes on, the better it's gonna be for me because I have two spike advantage over him. Okay, a couple of Devara tanks there. He's got the same the same eco as me. So we're gonna see if we can try and lure him out of position here. He's going to see this this trap that I'm setting up. Let's go ahead and scout here. Of course, he can use the scan to reveal what I'm doing. Let's get that shield upgrade online here as well. And we're going to hit him from multiple sides. So we're going to go over here. And then we're going to go ahead and heal this tripod here. And while that happens, Well, I guess that's it then. He's well out of position, actually. He's going Storm Riders. Problem with that, though, is... Um, I can just phase my stuff up. So I'm going to do now. That's why you don't go aircraft, because this happens. Also, let's not buff these storms. Um... Okay, I'm pretty happy about that. Going to retreat back to base. Does does do something, however, not quite enough to bring this one back. I do lose a single harvester, but that's really not quite enough. I don't believe. Interesting, nonetheless. Okay, well, I guess that is a pretty good uh, engagement you took there, after all. Storm Riders. I'll just spam tripods then. 
You want to be careful where he goes. Yeah, this is a problem now, isn't it? How do I contend with that? What we could do is we could uh, just eco here for a little bit. Get a couple more tripods out and then move out with our drone ship. That's probably going to be our best option. So we'll just sit here and, you know, sit on our advantage because we, we have two spikes currently. Make a couple of the sits. And he's not poking in to see what I'm doing, which is interesting. Okay, and yeah. Move forward my MCV. And push him. Gonna have plenty of uh, tripods here. He's got so many of those gun walkers though, hasn't he? Can I start to deploy this here, right here? Yeah. Glad I got the shard launchers now because that's exactly what I need. Yeah, that's a problem. He needs to use his stasis shield, I think. Oh, definitely. For sure. Needs to use that. Also, I'm seeing I'm running out of funds here, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab some of these harvesters and send them to this field. So what we're going to do is we're going to poke these harvesters. Okay. Wait, why? Oh, that may have been a mistake, actually. Oh my, why have I got dead? Oh my god. He's on tier, is he on tier three? I don't know how he's able to afford this. I have no idea how he's able to afford that, really. What I definitely do need, though, is a stasis. I should have had this sooner. Uh, this is the mistake I needed him to make just then. And that's basically gonna be it, I reckon, for panic now. Just can't contend with these with dev tanks. It's the best effort I've seen, though, with dev tanks. However, I don't think it's gonna be quite enough. I'm actually taking quite a lot of cannon damage here. Let's get back to base. It's got a double ref behind that as well. Holy, holy shit. That was actually really incredible. I've never seen Storm Riders work in a screen mirror before. I think I just reacted to it wrong. I think as I took that engagement without, uh, without, um, yeah, taking, I think I didn't get that blue tip either. I couldn't because of the Storm Riders. Man, Storm Riders, of all things, that was really incredible. Oh, 
he actually beat me with Storm Riders in the Squid and Mirror. 